Hello everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and welcome back to some more Project Naruto with me. I'm so tired. Oh god, New Year's messed me right up, so I was just like, nearly a week gone, I'm still so tired all the time. I feel like passing out at this point, it's great fun. I can't, because I need to go walk a dog. Dog will not let me sleep yet. Oh, it's a, what the f Feckles is this? Someone's used widgets around here. But anyway, yeah, so if I sound sleepy in this, it's because I really, really am. <laughs> like, I really just want to go to sleep all day. <laughs> Basically, I just want to rest, but I just, I can't rest. I can't get the sleep out of because Doggo, Doggo needs to go outside and Doggo demands attention. <laughs> Great fun! Right, anyway, record this. Let's do some Naruto. So, but oh, why am I there? It's not just to get a sight of my beautiful house, it's totally beautiful and it needs a roof so badly. Now, I'm over here because they built a thing. Now, during the stream that we did last time, which was a video yesterday, basically, I'd, yeah, I would have seen this making this thing, so I did some work on it. I mean, I, yeah, I love these uh, the carpenter, carpenter doors. Garage doors. Love the garage doors. Garage doors are brilliant. But, um, I did the place up a little bit to make it look a bit nicer. So, um, yeah, it's looking presentable now. It's looking presentable. It's, it's worth spending a bit of time in here now if we need to. Also, made a new iron scythe. New iron scythe. Its handle is pretty much just made of paper mache. And its top bit is really, really, really sharp. And that's pretty much it. I don't know how something like this could even function. Because it couldn't. It's literally got a paper handle. And a really heavy slash sharp top bit. But we don't question these things. The fact is, is that we've managed to glue it together and we're gonna make it work. And uh, yeah, another thing I've learned but I just didn't get around to doing is, uh, yeah, this place needs to be bigger. Slime? Feeling all right there. Uh-oh. I mean, wait, what? Yeah, maybe we just don't care about those managers. Maybe we just leave that alone. All uh, right. Anyway, this room needs to be bigger because the slimes are just they're not fitting perfectly as it is. It's just it's not being as efficient as it could be. So let's turn this off for now. Oh yeah, I also put more slime thingies on. Also, a lot of slimes are dying via wall. I don't know why. Like, this is really weird. I've made slime rooms before, and occasionally slimes would pop out the top, and they, they, they normally die, or they throw themselves into the pit and I end up killing them. Uh, but for some reason, a lot of slimes are spawning up top here. A lot of slimes are getting caught in the wall and dying. I don't know why. Because, like, normally this many don't. So it's, like, really, really weird. Uh, but, yeah, I'm going to have to make that room bigger regardless. Because we need more space to make it more efficient. Um, oh, yeah, also I've been getting a bunch of lip bags. Not really got much new narrative stuff from it, though. I mean, I've got some bits, but nothing insane. Like, I've opened a bunch of bags. I got one, uh, I didn't have a DNA, I've had no more mysteries, and I got three, uh, tailbeast shirts. Why they're the most common thing, I don't know, but they bloody are. Uh, I also get this thing, which is interesting, a clay pattern stimp. I don't know what that is, but if it says something about washing a cauldron, so I'll probably give that a go in a little bit. Uh, let's, uh, start this junk away as well before we do anything else. I went mining, uh, that's what this bit over here is for. I went mining down there. And got more resources and stuff, so we're loaded up in a bit more things, get more diamonds, get more lapis and redstone. Bit, 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 bit. Been smelling stuff down in the smeltery, that's been going well. Yeah, jelly, I just I've spent a bit of time getting some work done uh, today on the server. So that's been a thing. I also did some enchanting, so my current Amir is actually enchanted. You can't tell because it doesn't look it. Well, no, it does look it very, very faintly. Uh, but yeah, but you can see here. I took the time to like enchant all. Turns out, though, that this stuff can be enchanted. This stuff acts as armor wood. Cool. Uh, the sword, though, doesn't. The sword can't get sharpness on it, and I, I'm i quite confused to why, but it just can't. Uh, I guess because it just doesn't count as a sword for whatever reason. So, um, yeah, these swords, all we can get is, like, unbreaking on them. That's pretty much it. Which is kind of annoying, because I like to have more options, but never mind. That's just not the cards, apparently. So, pretty much we can only get on breaking on this sword. So, that sucks. Although, possibly there might be there might, there might be one way we can make it better. We need to experiment with it. We're going to be figuring that one out as time goes. As you understand what I mean a little bit. Right, let's quickly shove some junk away, though. Put this away. Put that away. Put that away. Put 
that away. Go put the iron stuff in the smeltery, put the heart in fucking there or something, I don't know. Right, I have made a blacksmith bit. It it looks crap. I put a garage door on it as well because of course it did. It, it doesn't look very good because of course it doesn't. It's one of my buildings. I'm not good at building roofs. Uh, I hate to improve on that. I'm not good at building in general to be honest. I think I'm better off building just, I'm better off just hauling out a mountain to be honest, just building and so you look. That tends to work out better for me. But yeah, we need to build actual villages. It's going to. Uh, 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 they're going to look questionable, aren't they? Yes. Yes, they are. Uh, right. Iron stove gets smelted. Let me drain a load of the iron out. And we take the iron and we use it. And actually, there is something. I yes. Thing. Go. Yes. Puddle. Yes. Right. There is something I want to use iron for anyway. I I've been running around naked for quite a while with this sword on my back and stuff. Just sealed into my back. We could probably upgrade now. Uh, it's probably about time we upgrade. So, yeah, let's maybe consider that. Let's think of upgrading. So, we're going to upgrade to some of the Naruto gear. Which, I mean, okay. Technically, we're wearing Naruto gear now. We're going to upgrade to better Naruto gear. Because there's better stuff out there. And I want it. Mainly, Madara's gear exists. And that's really good. There's also the flat jackets. Which is an option. But, unfortunately, because I don't have any pants on it, it would look very weird. Um, there's the Ambu mask, which I probably won't wear because I quite like having the headband on. But yeah, okay, the main thing is that, yeah, there's Madras gear, which is red armor plate, which is made from armor plate, which is made from reinforced fabric, which is made from fabric, which is made from wool. So, we should probably make some of that and make some Madras stuff because Madras stuff is quite good. Uh, is there any other stuff? No, Sekwa's not added very many pants. Sekwa's made all these outfit bits, and there's no pants. He's made flat jackets, but no pants to go with the flat jackets. God damn it, Sekwa. <laughs> you failed us. Uh, there's Naruto's gear, which we don't really care about. There's Barata's gear, if you're one of those types of people. Um, the rest isn't craftable. Right, so, yeah, I think I'm going to build Madara's stuff, just to give it a go. Wait a minute. The pants, though. Pants. Yeah, red and black. Alright. I need reinforced fabric. So we have some of that, I think. Yeah, we've got armor playing here, reinforced fabric here, fabric here, um, iron here, which has yeah, tons of iron. We've got wool somewhere. Yeah, tons of wool that I collected earlier. And red dye. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Yep, red dye and like that. Okay, see, I should have everything here to make Madras stuff. So let's make some of Madras stuff because it's strong armor and it means I won't be naked all the time. Which should be preferred. Uh, so yeah, it was, what, three of that plus... Do that first. Badish. Badish. No. Yes. Right. How much does this do I need? I need eight for the chest play and seven. I need 15 total. I already have two, so I need 13 total. So I need 15 total then. Great fun. No, I didn't! I already... <sighs> Damn it, Brian, you're too slow today. Right, okay, we're gonna have a bit of extra. That's fine. Right, reinforced fabric. We need one, two, three, four, four leggings. And then we need. Brain can't compute. What well, we need. Uh, yeah, okay, we. Uh, eight plus three. Eleven! Eleven is what we need. <laughs> ah. No! No, we didn't, because we already had to. Wait a minute, that's... Oh, no. Oh, that's not the right stuff. Oh, no, yes, it is. Oh, you confused me. Uh, wait, so that... That's the wrong stuff, right? Uh, let's try this again. So, right, put that there. Put that there. Reinforced. Then we move the reinforced over and we get the armor plating. There we go, that's better. Right, armor plating. Da Six of it. Died raids. And then. Wait. No, all. It's all died red. Yeah, it's all died red. What am I talking about? Right, so then it's. it's I've struggled this far more than I used to. It's all because my brain is just not going at full capacity today. 
Right, okay, so we got this red stuff, so what can we do? It's just it's just for that. That's not very good. Alright, never mind. Just pop that in there. That's fine. Right, well at least we this is done. So that's I have to worry about it now. Right, so let's see how this looks. So we take that off, take that off, but and now it looks Wait, what? Where's Oh, oh it's because the pants are turned off. Um Button. I was about to say, where's my pants? That's better. Sort of. I'm still barefoot. Why is Set gonna give us shoes yet? <laughs> why hasn't he given shoes? Like, he's got Madra's clothing. Like, why is Madra's clothing not including Madra's shoes? I guess because he assumes whoever is playing will just have their skin have the shoes, but I don't. I, I go naked so I can wear armor better. Uh, well, no matter. Right. What do we have for enchant wise? Uh, we've got unbreaking, which I think we'll need. We've got efficiency. Blah, blah, blah. Um, yeah. Okay, so I've got two lots of unbreaking I can put on. I need protection. So I think I think I want to enchant all our armor first. Like, yeah, enchant this junk. That way, if it's gonna like. You know, be crappy in chance it'll go in that first. I don't want to risk it and stuff. I don't know what this will. I can't even check what enchants are available in this. Can you... Wait, can this stuff even be enchanted? I... Possibly not. No, it can. Ah, I don't want to. Ah, fuck it, it. Should have done that. Uh, right, okay, that was a waste. Oh, that was a massive waste. What am I doing? Brain! You just wasted so many levels. <laughs> uh -huh. There's an order of things. This is why we just don't go. Fe we don't go feck it. We don't go go. We we do things in order, and you're supposed to put this. Oh, that was a lot of levels wasted there. <sighs> Plus that's crap, right? So that's failed. I instantly now need to take that off that because that's very bad. Fire protection is absolutely no use to me. I need protection. Um, alright, I've got a bunch of these things. I can also technically go kill slime. I really should put these bushes down. I've been walking about with them for bloody ages. Just fucking... <laughs> oh. Grab... Woods. Yes, there. Right, and then put... One, two, three. Oh, fuck, I don't care. You can have my levels. They're already gone anyway. Right. Grab all this. Uh, I'll worry about that later. Uh, Alright, put that there. There we go. Right, let that start growing and doing its thing. Right. Get my levels back. Da 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 da. There we go. Right, level 30. Then we go to the shoes. Not shoes. Yeah, shoes. There we are. Enchant. Protection 3 haste. There we go. Then we go over here. No, we don't because we don't get books right now. We grab books. Put that there. Put that there. Take protection. Badoosh. Yeah, put more levels in. Duh, 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 duh. Uh, I hope this is enough saved up to get this done. Wait, actually, question: If I find you with not you, da. No. Okay, so I need to take the thing off Madra's armor to. Uh... It's going to take so much of the durability off, though. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, no, it, it did this moment. Okay, that's not, that's not the worst thing. Madras armor really has low durability. Wow. 460. Uh, 560. That's pretty bad. I'm going to have to pay attention to the armor to make sure it doesn't die. That's going to suck. That was a waste of lots of experience there. I shouldn't have done that. I'm doing everything backwards today. Ah! <laughs> I'm just falling asleep. 
No matter. I think today's gonna be one of those days where I'm, just, I'm getting this done. I'm probably gonna be going bed early as possible and just, just collapsing asleep. Because, yeah, need it. Right. Other thing. Put. This has protection on it. Wait, what? Well, in that case, take the thing off that. Perfect. And then... Oh, feck it, we're already here. Might as well... Last time, last time. Okay, so that's completely useless. Right. Just ignore that then. How much does it cost to put... Not you. How much does it cost to put... Pro... Not you either. Protection on that. It's going to cost five levels. All right, grab five levels. That. No! Ah! That and that, and then put that with that is going to cost eight. All right, so now grab eight. That's one. Two, I don't care. But do it right. That's that's fine. That's a workable amount. We'll just agree with this armor is all right. Okay, this is fine. Um, I don't know what armor rating that gives me, but that with the shoes as well should be a bunch. So, but do right now. Toss that will double. Toss it all in. Just toss it all in. Doesn't matter. Organize it all later. Right. I've got that. That's the way. Now you still have to make experience bushes, but whatever. It got us what we need. We've now upgraded armor, sort of. I mean, we did, we did it in some of the most least efficient way possible, but we did it. God. Well, we're looking a bit better then. Very shiny. Very shiny boy today. Right. Oh, yeah. I should probably go over here and get whitelisted too. That'd be smart. Uh, let's do that quickly before I forget. So, Badoosh, whitelisting. Two people were whitelisted from the comment section. Uh, Hero Sara and Half Cooked, Half Hot. YouTube been whitelisted. Mod Pack IP went up. Should be down. Not shouldn't. It should be in Discord where it's meant to be. And then member side of things. I feel like a member, what? Is this Skimmin 55? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, because that, that was during the stream. Yeah, um,. I guess come in, uh, 55, you've been waiting, this is my pack of people not should be on Discord where it belongs. There we go. And as usual, people, you want to have a chance to wait list onto the server. Leave a like on the video along to end game down below for a chance to get on. And, or if you're a getting rank member or higher. Yeah. Uh, wait. Yeah, yeah, I said all that right there. My brain's like, wait, did you just say that right there? I think you said something there wrong. No. Yeah, if you're a getting rank member or higher and you want to get what this is. Let, uh, just let us know in game name and I'll whitelist you, no bother. <laughs> uh, oh, I'm struggling with everything today. It's one of those days. It's just one of those days that I just you sleeping. So, right, anyway. Things. Swords. Might be able to get stronger. So, currently it does six damage. It's pretty poor. It's not a very good sword, realistically. I can't put sharpness on it, so it doesn't get any better. And I just to show it doesn't put sharpness on it, like, I tried to enchant it in general. It just doesn't, like, enchant it. If I grab the book of Shabniels, I pop that down there. It doesn't work. So the only way that would work is if I went and like say creative mode and cheated on, but that's obviously can't be doing that. So well, you could, but you know we're not going to do that. So anyway, unless I put, I put the oh. could have someone put them on. Could have a custom NPC give it out. It's a thing you have to pay for. All right, over. We'll think of that later. Right. How can you power this up then? Well, it counts as a weapon and it bypasses the Naruto system, so if I get strength, it could work. Alright, so what can give us strength then? Well, if we get ourselves some Taijutsu abilities, aka I think it's the second or third one. Uh, yeah, here it is. I believe there's the Strong Fist style thing, which. If I remember correctly, it gives you a strength buff, which doesn't work. It doesn't work on Tinker stuff. It's useless on regular Naruto stuff because Naruto stuff falls on Naruto. It might work on this sword, though, but now they get strength and this may make it a bit stronger. So, could try getting that. Could try doing a bit of Taijutsu. Because, I mean, I've all I've got is Earth style anyway. I'm not going to use that. It's going to be a while before I get any other Jutsus. But I'll get more points anyway. So, I might as well unlock a bit of Taijutsu because I have no other options if I want to learn things. I want to do ninja stuff. So,. Yeah, let's learn a bit of Taijutsu, shall we? So, Badoosh, we are... That's not the right button. Badoosh, we're currently... We've got 16 points, fabulous. Level 114. We have got... 20 micro, 10 speed, blah, blah, blah. We put 10 Taijutsu, so we're going to put 14 Taijutsu to get up to the 
bare minimum of 50. We have 120 Fujitsu points to spend. It gives us plenty of Wigo Room to play with. So let's see if we can do this. So the first one's Thousand Beer Punch. The next one's Leap Hour Winds. How much does it cost? It's gonna cost seven. That's not too bad. Next up, Strong Fist. This is the one we're after. Badish. Strong Fist. So, right. After that, it's Dynamic Entry. We'll worry about that later. So, what that cost is there? It cost is 97 or 100 and something. It's not that much. Alright, so we can work with that. Now, if we use Strong Fist, that'll cost us 20 Chakra. And it'll drain our Chakra slowly over time. But. Well, actually, well, we don't know. Because we maintain it, though, because we gain Chakra. So, but it gives us strength. So now the question becomes, does it work on the does it make our katana stronger? Also, I just says, like, I've upgraded to this armor. This armor's got such low durability that it's probably not gonna, I'm not gonna be able to keep it, is that right? I'm fairly certain all the other Sequa's armor all has higher durability than this. But never mind, we'll worry about that later. We'll figure out a way to get a hold of it. Right, uh, now we've got strength. But for that, 29 points, I want to put some in ninjutsu. I think it's if you get ninjutsu up to 37? Yeah, so now I regen two at a time instead of one. Which is better. So, yeah, okay. That just gets us that little stage higher. Gives us two points left. I'm not going to spend those two points. Right, where's... Zodable? Where's something to fight? Bloop, small cut there, because, uh, yeah, bro, I just walked in asking about food. And then... Strangely, because my dog, my dog got up, and my dog was like, "Ooh, I'll go outside," and he went left with my brother. But then he wouldn't go in my brother's room, so he just sat outside. Then I went to go outside to shut my brother's door, so I couldn't hear his TV and stuff, so I could keep recording this. And my dog was just sitting there, saw me, and he came back in my room again. <laughs> my dog's being weird today. Uh, maybe he's tired too. Wouldn't blame him. He's been just keeping me up a lot. <laughs> Creep! Ah! Oh, that did do more. Oh! Oh! It works! Of course it does. It makes logical sense that it works. But still, I'm still surprised it works. So, we go from 6 to 13. That's not great, but it's something. <laughs> it's, it's, it's not great at all. It's actually still terrible. Well, it's not terrible. I mean, 13 damage is still alright. It's just when it comes to resting against people with hundreds of health, it's not going to do very much. Hundreds of health plus heavily armoured, it's not going to be doing very much. But it's something, I suppose. I mean, I guess Sabas is sort of getting even stronger. If I get a hold of that and get enchantment on it, it would be better. She does not piercing enchant. But anyway, regardless, that means, yeah, if we use strong fists, we can power up that sword if we want to. That's an option. Arguably, my scythe might just be flat better, though. <laughs> I don't know. My scythe, my scythe might generally just be better for use. Not sure. Also, store. Put all that away. There we go. Also, yeah, this stuff's terrible as well. I generally don't know what Mathiox thinks, and he makes the, the, the way he did. Like, he's clearly never played his own mods. Like, in a setting with other people and stuff. Because it's just, it's it's so poorly balanced in terms of what you've got against what you can get and things. Ugh. The health system, you need, we need so much less health for this stuff to be threatening. Like, six damage is nothing. Especially when it's got a massive kill then as well. Six damage, you're better off just taking an iron sword and hitting someone. Than that. But no, you've got to get 50 levels in it and stuff. It's ugh. His mod makes no sense. Like, we already know this, though. We've ranted about this before. Maybe someday he'll come back. Or maybe someday he'll let someone else take it over and they'll, you know, rebalance it and rejig it so it actually makes sense and is actually good in that way. Because, you know, you can look at so many logic flaws in this mod. Like, just this, like, Kenjutsu thing. You have to have 50 Kenjutsu to use a wooden sword. You have to have like a hundred, a hundred and fifty to use an iron sword, and two hundred to use a diamond sword. That's one extra damage for a diamond sword. It, it's stupid. But on top of that, to get a wooden sword, you have to be level fifty. At level twenty-six, I think it is. That's the point when you can't kill non-hostile mobs. So from twenty-six to fifty, which is a bunch of mobs, you've got to kill violent mobs. But you're not allowed to use even a wooden sword. It's like. What's the point in that? 
you got to get hundreds of levels it is if you want to do anything in this mod. So why are you making it so people can't use junk rages? I, the whole system of uh, the wooden sword falls out your hand. What, because you're so stupid you're not able to hold the swords? Because you're just going to drop it instantly, like... I can understand if you're not good at Kenjutsu that you don't get any bonuses. But it should happen. What realistically should happen with the Kenjutsu system is you should be able to use the sword straight away. And as you put more points in Kenjutsu, you do more damage with the sword. And with Taijutsu, you start off normal, and then as it goes up, you do more damage with your fists. And with the Taijutsu moves. Would that not make more logical sense? I don't know. I think it does to me. But either way, no matter. Uh, yeah, this is turned off. Okay, blah, blah. Don't know why I came back down here, to be honest. Uh, yeah, just toss it your way. We don't need Joe. Yeah, I want to check something, actually. Right, hold on. We've got that new... I'm gonna make the Ombu vest. Hold on. I'm gonna make this really quick. I mean, first black fabric and armor plate. Uh, I'm gonna make this really quick. Just because I want to I want to check the durability. So I'm wondering if Sekko made this more durable. Because I swear Sekko had a thing that was more durable. Also, what do I need for this? Hold on. Uh, we need... Yeah, 10 reinforced fabric and it... No. We need 10 armor plate. No, 6 armor plate. And 2 black reinforced fabric. Okay. So, but do but do. Will plus iron plus. Don't think there's any other. No, I think I used all the fabric in that, right? Ye. Right. Okay. Make the thing. Um. So, badish, badish. That's not going to be enough. Ah, da ba. Right, um. More iron. I think I'm gonna need more will as well, because I think. Yeah, I'm gonna be one bloody short. Hold on. Oh, I keep it the wrong way. But two. One, two. Yeah, so you get this stuff. Plus this. Right. Out of curiosity, why don't we put this on? Yeah. There's no pants to go with this is the problem. Right, now I need to get hit by something. I want to see, what's the durability in this bad boy? Also, oh, should I just go leaf or win something? Just for the sake of it. Aye, let's go do that. Let's go pick a fight with something. Uh, we look ridiculous. <laughs> we look ridiculous. It looks even worse. If we take that off, it looks even worse. Like... It looks like someone who forgot to get fully dressed. That's not much better, though. Damn it, Sekko, we need shoes and pants. <laughs> because he made all the armor sets all the one armor thing. There's, like, where's our, where's our leaf village ninja pants? Like, why is the flat jacket just there and the pants aren't? But yeah, the pants are there. Because if you build Kakashi's thing, the bottom half is the ninja pants. <laughs> Damn it, Sekko. Ah. Oh. He's so focused on the chest plate, he's not even considered the pants we might need to, you know, complete the look. But never mind. Leave Warrowind! Oh, feck, I just picked a fight of many things. You miss! No, you didn't. Ow! You can die now. No, it's got low durability too. I thought something had higher durability. I must be thinking of something else. Probably. I have you a bunch of mods. Also, can you die, please? Thank y'all. Ah, uh, I'm poisoned. Oh, that's annoying. Right, well, we'll keep a hold of the Ambu chest plate for later. I mean, probably not use it, because it's got nothing to go with it, but you know. Because it, what, well, at best we've got, what, well, uh, we've got iron pants. Oh, yeah, I built this thing, too. That was a thing. Right, hold on, put that back, put that all, put that all, put that all that way, that way. Let's throw this junk away. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Bam bam. I think we'll get more will there, but that's fine. Shove that in there, why not? I made this thing. I made a grapple gun. So, like, basically. What the hell? It takes aim. 
And it basically will make a bridge. So you're supposed to use string and... I don't have any string. I have some string. I have very little string. You're supposed to use string and hash slabs. And basically you can create little bridges with it instantly. Which is seems kind of kill on paper. Because, well, it is the sort of But the bridges themselves, the bridges are alright. The bridges are alright, but they're a bit they're a bit finicky for, you know, placing down the, kind of appropriately. So hold on. If we go, like, over... I was going to say over faking here, but I just completely overleaped that there. Um, yeah, let's say we want to make one from here to fecking. Ugh. There's no good spots here. I want to make one closer. You know what? Yeah, to there. To there, it'll do lovely. Right, so we want to make a bridge from over here to over there. So we're going to go skadoosh. There we go. That one actually worked out kind of alright. But yeah, basically that just drained, what, seven string and a bunch of wood slips. And, yeah, basically it just makes bridges over the place. I think it's going to be pretty cool if you're up in the mountains and stuff. You need a lot of string for it, though. Come on. Come fight me, then. Ah, I can nowhere to go now. It's a straight road. Yeah, I'm saying, like, if you live up in the mountains. I have a lot of mountains here. I could just put bridges. Or I could create a bunch of tall buildings and put bridges. Let me think is there's no side panels. <laughs> there's nothing to stop you. You just fall off. Very, like, uh, they look cool, though. They look cool, but they're a danger hazard. But then again, we're ninjas, so I suppose it wouldn't matter. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, this is fine. I think if we build some tall, temporary things in the village, we could just put those around. I kind of want to, I, I want to use them. <laughs> That's a plan there. That's a plan there. Oh, yeah, and people have been building near her again. Oh, when do people learn? <laughs> Said, don't build anywhere near me. What did they do? They build near me. Well, it's their risk. I did warn them. I've warned people if they build near me, I need to I need to work over here at some point, which I might. Then the things just gonna get turned in. And you only have yourself to blame. But as as uh, up I hear a spider. Eh, uh, like let's just return the junk we just picked up there. But the ball. That that that. Wait, what? What are you doing in here? How are you in here? Where that? How did it spawn in here? What? Like, I get this middle part here is a bit dark. I thought this place was too lit up for them to spawn. That's a bit weird. Um. Well then, that was odd. Right. No matter. The ball. Oh yeah, I should probably go put this other stuff in for smelling as well. I've been carrying around this stuff, right? I've got no reason, so I should probably go put it in for smelling. But the, right, grapple gun can just stay in there for now, though. So I've got to grab loads of string. I'm trying to think where to get loads of string. Oh no, the bank shafts. What the hell? Excuse me. You're heavily armored, mate. But uh oh. Wait, how's this gonna work? Go, my clones! Attack! Okay, so because it can't register what I'm holding in my hand, it literally... Yeah. Go, superior clones with the swords and stuff. Yeah, these ones apparently have swords in hand. So, those ones couldn't register what I had in my hand because I had the scythe. So, they were getting... Like, it was just doing one damage. But because the, the new ones think I've got a sword in my hand, even though they're not showing the sword... Why is this... Oh, it was because the shoes are on. Yeah! Because I had those shoes on! Hmm. Yeah, I need to find shoes that I can wear with this armor that isn't Naruto ones. And I actually do know a set. I know a good set. The bits of the Traveler from Thumbcrafts. If I could get my hands on those bad boys. Then my clones wouldn't look so weird. Oh, I just remember that's literally the. That, that, I'm pretty sure that's the setup I used to use. This is the setup I used to use in Naruto Season 1. I'm just thinking about it. It's like, yeah, I used to wear Sekwa's headband. Sekwa's... The, the Madra armor. Then I had the bits of the Traveler. I'm pretty sure on. Like, that that was my get -up. That was my look. Uh, pretty much for most of the series. Along with whatever abilities I get my hands on. Oh, the memories. Can you die, please? Thank you. Well, that look will be coming back. Because apparently I'm going to start thumb crash so I can just get those bits. That's just simply so I can have a pair of shoes on that I can actually see. Because... 
I, c I could run about barefoot, but I don't really want to. Hello, spider. Bye, please. Yeah, I can't put looting on my sword either. That's sad. Oh, why does this sword not count as a sword? I don't know. That's quite odd. Right, uh, put that way. That way, that way. Alright, let's let all that smelt away. Da, 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 da. But yeah, so I guess I'm going to just build more bits. Uh, Thumbcraft is mostly just research based. I probably should do that off camera. Or bits on streams when I've got the energy. I don't think that's something we want to do on camera. <laughs> I don't think that'll end too well. Err, because it will just be me mostly staring at a bit of paper trying to figure out how two things go together, because that's literally what Thumbcraft is. Right, right, we'll shove these shoes on for now. So, well, things should be getting up to. What other things do I need next? I'll just, like, I'm now, I'm able to grind now. I need to make the thing a bit bigger, but that's fine, I'll work on that. I can rejig that room when the time comes. Good, I've got a bit more resources and stuff now. What's the next thing we need around here? I mean, obviously these buildings all need roofs, but you know, it's me. Eventually they might get some type of roof, or they just won't. We'll figure that one out later. And now, other than building tall towers everywhere for literally no reason, all in just to put bridges on them. What else do we need here? I think the shop basically is the big thing, isn't it? Shop or food stand? Ramen stand. Something to think about. Uh, Die, please. Thank you. I really should also figure out marking which area is my land and like tearing down some of these hills and stuff. Oh, people have built so close to me though. <laughs> it's a silly idea of building so close to me because it's never going to work for you because I'm going to destroy the place. People don't listen. Ah. Oh. I want to say I'd feel bad doing it, but I'm going to take great pleasure in tearing down their houses. Like, <laughs> there's going to be no sympathy at the end of this. Alright, um... Because they've been warned. It's just how it is at that point. Also... I'm, I'm wondering, like, how high did I have the freaking... Or how low did I have the bag spawn rate in the previous series? Like, last time I did an Arto series, bags were, like, super rare. And yet this time I increased the bag rate so it's not it's not default or anything like that. But you know, I I increased it, but apparently it's like a lot less. I must have had it ridiculously high before. Well, I, I keep saying high. Basically for uh loot bags it's like there's a number. A default number is a thousand. And pretty much the higher the number is, the less chance there is of it spawning. So I think it's like one in it's not even one in that chance. Because if you put the number down from a thousand down to a hundred, then it's a guarantee. Like you, you always get bags. Because when I, when I first tried to switch the number and I put it down to a hundred, then at that point you were getting a bag every kill. So I don't know exactly what the odds are, like percentage wise and stuff. But basically, the higher number is the less chance there is. So normally I increase the number up. I I must have put it something ridiculous last Naruto season. Because <laughs> we got barely any bags, whereas now I feel like we're getting tons all the time. Ah, oh, it feels odd. All right, oh yeah, grab. Grab resources. I need to secure this area off so like there's too many mobs getting in. <laughs> like maybe maybe chuck tear down this chunk bit here. Yeah, because there's no there's no planes bit right here. Tear down this hill here. Tear down whatever the fuck is going on here. And build a couple more buildings. What do I need? I need to, I make, I need to make a board actually. I make a board and like take note of what buildings I need currently. Cause now I need shop, I need ramen. Stand place, possibly just food place in general, just a place that sells food would be nice. We can get some more use at the Naruto currency. Um, what else do we need beyond that? <laughs> it's a necessity right now. It's uh, a good question. Let us know in the comments, because I can't think right now. My brain just wants to fall asleep. But I can't fall asleep, because I have to just need to take Doggo out. And it's still really early, so... <laughs> Even if I were to fall asleep now, I'd get it most like two hours, then Dog would want to go to another, like, another walk, so... God damn it. Oh, it's one of those things, though. It needs to be done. Doggo needs to get outside. Right, anyway, yeah. Let us know in the comments what things you think I should build. I'm going to make a board for that. Ah, I can grind off camera and give my resources off camera. Yeah, I think for today, given the fact that I generally feel like falling unconscious, I'm going to end this video here. So thank you all very much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed the show and my mindless rambling. 
And, uh, yeah, Project Narrative, we're moving on bit by bit. Uh, I'll just continue improving things bit by bit off camera. We'll grind more off camera. And we'll figure out what we're building and doing next. Because we're going to start working on stuff now that we've got... We've got our resources. We've got our tools now. We've got our resources. We can get stronger. We can learn moves. We've, done, we've gotten some of the nitty-gritty bits out of the way. Now I just need to start putting things together and start making, like, bits for village and... Basically constructing things. And arena, that's another thing I need to build at some point. I need to build some type of arena that we can all fight in. Preferably soon so we can start making use of it. Because all those fancy swords and outfits are right there. And somebody probably wants them. But right. Anyway, regardless, thank you all very much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed the show. We'll see you all next time for some more Project Naruto. Where hopefully after today, if I fall asleep early, I can just wake up tomorrow and actually feel fresh and awake. <laughs> That'd be a miracle. Ah, oh, I want to. If I get my sleeping schedule fixed, hopefully come next week or uh, come the start of the new week, come Monday, I should hopefully just be feeling better. <laughs> I can get back on like recording grind and start doing more videos and live streams and stuff again. Ah, oh, yeah, fingers crossed that all works out for me. Right, regardless. Anyway, thank you all for watching. See you the next time for my project Naruto. Go, bye everybody. Also, just want to say a quick thank you to our channel members and a special thank you and shout out to our elite members, the Jonin, Matthew LK, and Cheekston, and our Anbu, Kyle the Young, and one Blackwing Dragon. Thank you all very much for the extra support, Baddor.